So the next useful tool in AutoCAD is a subtract tool, which basically you'll have two or more objects, and you're going to subtract one or more objects from another object. Um, for example, I have this cylinder here, and if I wanted to make it hollow as like a pipe or something, um, I have so I have this shape, and it is um, as a it's 20 inches high by with a 10 inch diameter. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is make another shape. So I'm going to go into my top view. Um, I'm going to take another circle, and I'm going to make sure of my snap on to center. Hit that center and say I want this pipe to be two inches thick so I'm gonna make it a uh, eight inch radius. Um, then what I'm gonna need to do is I'm going to need to subtract this piece from this piece but because this piece is only two-dimensional and this is a three-dimensional piece. I'm going to need to give this a third dimension. So I'm going to go extrude and negative 20, which is the height of the bigger cylinder. Um, I'm going to make sure that it extruded the correct way, which it did. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to enter subtract in the keyboard. And the first thing you want to do is select the object that you want to keep. So basically the object that you're going to have the stuff subtracted from. So in this case it's the bigger cylinder. And then you press enter. Then you're going to subtract, select the object that you want to subtract from it, which in this case is a smaller one. And then press enter. And so at this point, this is only one piece. So if I go into a rendered view, you'll notice that it is hollow like a tube, like so. And that is the subtraction tool. And you can also subtract more than one object from one object at a time.